In this video, we'll delve into the fascinating world of p-adic numbers and discover a hidden pattern within the powers of 2. You're probably familiar with the powers of 2, but did you know there's a unique structure hiding in their digits? Let's explore it together. To visualize this pattern, let's assign a different color to each digit from 0 to 9 and align them to the right. This way, digits in the 1's place will be in the same column, as will those in the 10's place and so on. By expanding the triangle and adding more rows, we can observe a seemingly random structure within. However, if we focus on specific rows like the 1st, 10th, 100th, and so on, we notice something intriguing. The last few digits of 2 raised to the power of 10 raised to the power of n plus 1 are exactly the same as the last few digits of 2 raised to the power of 10 raised to the power of n. As we increase n, the agreement between these numbers becomes stronger, suggesting convergence. But it's important to note that this convergence is different from what we're used to. In the usual sense, as n increases, 2 raised to the power of 10 raised to the power of n diverges to infinity rather than converging to a specific value. So what exactly do these sequences of digits represent? We've actually stumbled upon a number system different from the one we're accustomed to. In this alternative number system, known as the p-adic numbers, these seemingly infinite numbers make sense. The p-adic numbers offer an alternative to the real numbers, and they prove useful in various situations. Before we delve deeper, let's take a moment to appreciate why we value the real numbers. They provide a clear visual representation of points on the number line and encompass all integers and rational numbers. Real numbers support addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. They also contain all their limit points, ensuring no gaps in the number line. While real numbers don't satisfy all our requirements, for example, they lack square roots of minus 1, they are generally reliable. However, the real numbers are not the only option. There exist alternative number systems, such as the p-adic numbers, which possess similar useful properties and even extend beyond what the real numbers offer. Some p-adic systems even include square roots of minus 1, these number systems are named after prime numbers, such as the 2 addicts, 3 addicts, and so on. While their names may not be as intuitive, neither is the real numbers, when you think about it. To comprehend p addic numbers, let's shift our focus from powers of 2 to powers of 10. Surprisingly, as we increase the power of 10, every digit eventually becomes 0. This means that 10 raised to the power of n gets closer and closer to a number with all its digits equal to 0 which is 0 itself. As powers of 10 tend towards 0, they are considered small numbers within this alternative perspective. To formalize this notion, we introduce a new absolute value. We determine the highest power of 10 that divides a number and then divide 1 by that power of 10. This resulting value becomes the number's 10 attic absolute value. For instance, if a number is divisible by 1000 not by 10 to the power of 10, its 10 attic absolute value would be 1, 10 to the power of 9. This absolute value measures how small a number is in the 10 attic number system. Now, let's consider the p attic numbers, where p represents any prime number. In the p attic number system, the digits are not arranged in a decimal system like in the real numbers. Instead, they follow a pattern based on powers of page just as we saw with powers of 10. In the p attic system, as we increase the power of p, every digit eventually becomes zero. To define the p attic absolute value, we determine the highest power of p that divides a number and divide one by that power of page this resulting value becomes the number's p attic absolute value. For example, if a number is divisible by p cubed but not by p caret 4, its p attic absolute value is 1 p cubed. The p attic absolute value measures how small a number is within the p attic number system. In this alternative number system, smaller numbers have larger absolute values. This is in contrast to the real numbers, where smaller numbers have smaller absolute values. One of the fascinating aspects of p attic numbers is their convergent behavior. In the real numbers, as we take larger powers of a number, such as 2 or 10, the numbers diverge to infinity. However, in the p-adic numbers, as we take larger powers of a number, the numbers converge to a specific value. This allows for a different type of mathematical analysis and provides a unique perspective on number theory. p 
p-adic numbers have applications in various fields, including number theory, algebraic geometry, and cryptography. They offer alternative approaches to solving equations and provide insights into the properties of prime numbers and their factorizations. P-adic numbers also play a role in understanding phenomena related to fractals and self-similarity. In conclusion, the exploration of p-adic numbers reveals a different number system that diverges from the familiar real numbers. These alternative number systems, named after prime numbers, possess unique properties and offer a different perspective on mathematical analysis. The p-adic numbers provide convergence where the real numbers diverge, opening up new avenues for exploration and application in various mathematical disciplines.